Well, while checking public records, EverythingLubbock.com found a demolition permit for the God Bold Center at the corner of 19th Street and University Avenue. This news coming just days after City Council rejected a up campus's proposed zoning request in the Tech Terrace neighborhood where developers have been trying to put up new student housing for quite a while. Carlton Godbold purchased the building in the 1990s, but the history of the building dates back to the 30s. KLBK's Jaxie Pigeon spoke with Godbold's goddaughter this afternoon to hear her thoughts on losing what she calls her home away from home. Well, Terry, Darcy Asian worked with her godfather at that property for nearly 20 years. She says so much of the city's beginnings were lost in the tornado of the 70s, so she's truly heartbroken by the news that a place like the Godbold Center, filled with so much history, is set to be demolished. I just don't want the building to be destroyed. With the city's approval, it's likely just a matter of time before the Godbold Cultural Center will be demolished. Over the years, developers have been trying to put up everything from a high-rise hotel to new student housing. It was Darcy Asian's godfather, Carlton Godbold, who bought it in 1993. He wanted to give some culture to Lubbock, so he had different artists and musical events. It has a rich history, originally built as a hospital in 1937. It then became a hotel in the 70s and home to the University City Club up until the late 80s. But major renovations in the 90s would turn it into a live music and event venue. I just got to grow up listening to some of the most beautiful music, eating great food, wonderful art shows. There was like a different art show there like all the time. Asian attended Tech in 1996 and asked Godbold if she could work for him. Not only did she get the job, but she also lived inside. I worked every little job there from gardening to cleaning to dishes to serving. I lived there and went to school and um, there was like a little uh, spot right in front of my room that ha I could sit in the windowsill and listen to the music. From Natalie Maines of the Chicks to the godfather of West Texas music Tommy Hancock, the Godbold hosted many famous live musicians. Ray w Wiley Hubbard to Godbold, that was a treat, thanks. And then let's see, uh, Terry Hendricks here, thanks Godbold. And Asian is heartbroken to lose this building filled with so much history in the hub city. Don't tear it down. I mean, it, it's, it's a wonderful location for weddings and events and nothing they build could be as, as cool or as beautiful. The demolition permit expires on August 29th. The city did confirm that the area which houses Cafe J is not up for demolition.